guys it's a beautiful day here in Riyadh it's 2 26 p.m. Thursday checking in 1st of April um, I'm about to meet the owner of the Wild agency with regards of this documentary film the 10 days um, tour project as a Saudi Arabia documentary film that will be launched on an Italian channel. Okay, that sounds really dope, but hear me out. That's not the whole story. I'm gonna find out later at 4 p.m. And I'm just kind of like getting ready. Um, I have no expectations, honestly, because I never thought that I, I'd be here in Riyadh, not in Dubai, not in Australia. So actually, like, it's so mind blowing for me to be here. Um. I didn't get my bag with me. I decided to not bring that much today. So I decided to just use my laptop bag. And I don't know how long the meeting will last. So let's just say that my goal for this meeting is to make sure that this project is real. <laughs> like how real could it get in terms of the stability of my career? Um, thinking about my parents at home because they're the reason why I've been pushing myself in the next three more months before I turn 27 to actually find a stable career and this is like one of my prayers to like get answered one is for this IMG model um, application that's still on hold I have to do another photo shoot just because I didn't meet the criteria they needed for me secondly is the Rawahal agency which I'm here how am I feeling? I feel fine, I guess. So yeah, I just got a message from one of the photographers who's gonna do the shoot for me. He's actually the previous photographer who did my portfolio for IMG. It just so happened when we when we did the shoot. Although I did uh, I did tell him that like we have to do a full body shots, but this the studio itself wasn't like. Sorry about that noise. So yeah, the studio wasn't really helping, so that's why I gotta do it again, because I just gave the IMG the portfolio that's like half body, which I thought that I could get away from it, turned out that I can't. So just a quick update of what's going down here in Riyadh, and um, I'm gonna get my vitamin C ready, okay, let me just do that. So, I actually flew to Riyadh feeling sick, so I got myself covered with a lot of flu kit, which is got the vitamin C, got the ginger tabs, I have to be taking them to boost my immunity because recently, I don't know, it's been crazy, I'm really, really trying my very best to take care of myself. Anyways, enough about me, what will you be expecting in this video? the Mitra Wahala Agency to give you a tour of what Riyadh looks like because yeah it's, it's also my first time being here so I took a few clips from the airport um, and then hopefully tomorrow when I do this um, when I visit the edge of the world which is pretty exciting yeah like this exciting so yeah, that's a wrap. So stay tuned. Thanks. Thanks for watching my YouTube channel. It's just a simple vlog for you guys. What's to go down?
show you this place right here. How close are we? Uh, 25 minutes more. 25 minutes more. 25 minutes more. What's what's now? What am I gonna expect within this 25 minutes? Just just on the road. He just did that on purpose, didn't he? He just he just rally raced on me. It's actually uh, an international rally racer, so he's pro skills. What are you? Oh wow! Lumps on the way. Okay, we just finally reached it. Oh my god! It's so pretty. Look. Although I did a skydive, but problem, I can catch you from your hair. It's ah. okay. Be careful because you're holding the camera. I'm just gonna crawl like this because it's um, I'm good. Oh, you you want to see how far, uh, like how how I'd fall like that from? That's scary. I got myself covered. Like, mm -hmm. No, no, it's, it's fine. Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright. Wait. Okay. Okay, there you go. Just one. Just one leg. Okay, hey, just one leg, right. Okay. Okay. I literally just broke. <sighs> You have no idea how I feel right now. Oh. You know, I never thought that I became so scared. So, 8.50, whoa, did I just check it, right? 8.50 and I'm just like, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. I feel like I need to walk from everything that just happened right now. Okay, so I'm like, hello? Are you leaving me? guy right here it's exactly the reason why my makeup pouch is here it fell off I think you're harsh by nature well thank you I was told
visit a cave, which is pretty interesting. I'll show you what it looks like in a while. Hey guys, it's um 10:23 um, p.m. <laughs> I'm pretty speechless right now. Um, as you know, that I just got back to my hotel, and I'm in the position of feeling like I don't know what to say. It's like a mixed emotion. You know what I mean? Like I just got accepted to be one of the seven girls to be part of a, this big documentary film. And it's insane, really. Um, I don't know, I might end up going to Riyadh and something like that, and I'm just, I don't know what to feel. Um, but at the same time, I'm excited. Okay, a lot of things happen, and it's Crazy. Three things I gotta work on. Changing my mind. Working more on myself. And... Um, having a business mentor. That I kind of look up to. And guide and have to be guided by it. You know what I mean? So... I don't know. I don't know how things are gonna turn out. But... If I end up like going to, I don't know how my 2021 is gonna look like, but I do have faith that all these things that's happening at the moment, 